It's time for Rabbi Minkowitz's weekly Torah lesson, a place where life's most difficult questions are answered. Here with his spiritual perspective and insight, Rabbi Minkowitz. Welcome to this week's Torah lesson. This week's Torah portion is Parashas Toldos. The question of the week is, how far do you have to go to help somebody? So in this week's Torah portion, Parashas Toldos, the opening verse in the Torah portion says, Ve'ela Toldos Yitzchak ben Avram. This is the offspring of Yitzchak, the son of Avraham. So we already know that Yitzchak's the son, Abraham is the father. But the Torah repeats itself and tells us, Avraham hoyledes Yitzchak, Avraham gave birth to Yitzchak. So the question is asked, the Torah just told us that Yitzchak was the son of Avraham. It's obvious that Avraham was the father of Yitzchak. So Rashi explains, one of the reasons is, because... Avraham lived with many, for many years with Sarah, couldn't have any ch- children. So everyone was saying, ah, guess what? You know where Sarah became pregnant from? Not from Avraham. She became pregnant from Avimelech. So therefore, what did God do? He made that, it should, that Yitzchak should have the same image as Avraham. So the question is, doesn't a child look like their parents? What does God have to do to make something special? So the Rebbe explains a fascinating insight, and he says like this. We know that Avraham Avinu was the Kav was the attribute that's very strongly of chesed, of kindness. Yitzchak had a strong attribute of gevura, severity. And kindness and severity is two different worlds. Chesed is about giving, is about love. Yitzchak is about uh, discipline, about awe. Two different worlds. Opposite worlds. And they don't look alike. And normally if you would look at someone like Avram, you would see a personality of chesed. You would look at someone like Yitzchak, you would see a personality of, of gevura. Why? Because that's the nature of Gvur and Chesed. They don't blend. But here, because people were saying that Sarah became pregnant, God forbid, from Avimelech, so Hashem went ahead and he made that Yitzchak, even though he's Gvura, and Gvur is not like Chesed, that Gvur should look like Chesed. Hashem changed the laws of nature just to cover up the shame, God forbid, that people were saying that possibly Sarah became pregnant from Avimelech. So what is so to answer the question, how far do you have to go to help someone? Look with God that He changed the nature that Gvura should look like Chesed. How much more so we need to do whatever we can to help other people, even if it means sometimes going against our nature. This week's Torah lesson is in memory of Baruch ben Ari Leib and Shlomo ben Yosef. May their souls be elevated to the Torah that we're studying in their memory. Thanks so much for joining us for our weekly Torah lesson. For more information on Chabad, please see our website.